When I'm on the road, I like to bring a folding bike with me and my Prius whenever possible, and I like to ride it and get some exercise. Vegas is full of stoplights, stop signs, and dangerous things, so I have found a spot in Vegas where it's pretty safe to do laps. So I'm going to show you right here on this map and give you a little tour. This is in the Arts District, just north of West Charleston Boulevard, so it's between the Strip and downtown. Look up the Burlesque Hall of Fame and you'll find it. That's where this loop is. So Commerce Street goes south, and it's one way only, and then Main Street goes north, so that's your loop. This is starting out on Main Street. You can see it's well lit and there is a designated bike lane. It is a one-way street, so there's no oncoming traffic. You just have to worry about the people behind you and you're pretty safe in that bike lane if you stay in it. And as you're riding along, you can see up here on the right, if you don't have your own bicycle, you could even come here and rent one of those city bikes. And they like there's a daily fee and then you have to pay after 30 minutes for any minutes that you use. So you could even run a Criterion and do 28 minutes of biking, then plug it back in and then pull it back out and then um, start over and basically ride all day for $1.50 or whatever the, the daily price is. Um, up here on the right is a really good Mexican restaurant, Letty's. You can look them up on Yelp. I had the tamales this time and everything there is good. So I recommend that. You, you get your exercise and then you, you go in there and get some uh, recovery tamales. And then as we're getting to the end of the street here, there's a big giant sculpture and there is a stop sign here. So here you're gonna get oncoming traffic from the north. So you wanna make sure nobody is gonna run you over as you go around that corner. That sculpture kind of makes it hard to see the oncoming traffic. So you wanna be careful with that. And then you're into this northbound lane that is less well lit and there's some, some creepy walking dead homeless people here sometimes. But overall, I didn't really feel too dangerous when I was riding through here. And this is me going into the wind. So I don't know if the wind blows all the time in Vegas or how hard it blows, but on this night, it was killing me going southbound. And then I felt like Lance Armstrong going north. So let's look at the overall numbers here. I mean, basically, there's, there's two stop signs on this street. The one that we just ran through on the north side. And then when you get up back up to the top and you're merging onto Main Street, there's another stop sign. But you can essentially just, just do hot laps here all night long and nobody's going to get in your way. And you're going to ride till you drop. So in half an hour, I did 6.3 miles, and that was over seven laps. And here's a look at my speed. So I'm not particularly fast, and neither is my bike, but I was able to get seven laps in at 12.3 miles an hour. You can see the, the speed goes up when the wind's behind me, and it goes way down when I'm having to push against it. But great way to get some training in when you're in Vegas. So I hope this helps somebody out there. Thanks for watching.